Today we're going to make these delicious gluten-free, dairy-free, peppermint and chocolate swirl cookies. To start them off, set your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and then we're going to add in two cups of almond flour and a half cup of coconut flour. Half teaspoon of baking soda and a half teaspoon of baking powder. And look at these cute little measuring spoons I got. I got them at Francesca's. And then a fourth a teaspoon of real salt. One egg. A teaspoon of vanilla extract. Two tablespoons of coconut oil. Third cup of honey. And then mix that all up in the mixer until it's a smooth dough. Once that's done, take half of the dough out of the mixer. With the remaining half, add three tablespoons of cocoa powder. And mix that together. Once that's done, it will look like this. With the other half, add two drops of peppermint essential oil and mix that up. Place each dough ball in between two sheets of wax paper. They're supposed to be about a quarter of an inch thick. Then take off the top of each of the sheets and then turn one of the sheets over on top of the other one. So I'm going to try this one. So let's roll it. Chill this in the refrigerator for 30 minutes. So I will see you back here in 30 minutes. Now this is out of the fridge. We're going to unroll it and cut it into slices. It smells so good. And we're going to bake these for 8 to 10 minutes. Merry Christmas everybody! That is how to make peppermint squirrel cookies that are gluten-free, dairy-free, paleo, all great things for the holiday season that will be good for your stomach. Now it's time to pour yourself a, mug, a Christmas mug of dairy-free milk yourself a peppermint swirl cookie and taste them. They're not bad. Thanks so much for watching you guys. I hope you enjoyed this baking video. I hope you guys have a merry merry Christmas. I hope you've enjoyed the 25 days of Kishmas. I really enjoyed making these videos for you. It's been really, really fun for me. If you guys enjoyed this video, then please let me know by subscribing, commenting down below, and liking the video. And share it with a friend that you think would like this video as well. Thanks so much. As for that, you are so lovely, and I will see you next time with a new video. Bye! to Keisha that just gets much more fun thumbs up and comment below now you are so lovely if you enjoy watching here's what you can do to find a mixture of lovely videos
video, subscribe to Keisha Egbert.